TYT Sports, Francis Maxwell here. So, you believed that you would win? I didn't. I believed that you would make it through, and you did. So, the United States have made it through to the last 16 in their game against Germany, ending 1 0 to the Germans. Uh, Thomas Muller adding to his uh, unbelievable amount of goals for Germany already. I think there's 24 goals between him and Klose in the last four World Cups, whereas England as a total have only had 17. I, I don't know why I threw England in there, but anyway. Uh, so the United States came out and uh, with a change in their team, Omar Gonzalez coming at the back four um, ahead of Cameron. And there, and Davis coming out wide left, and it looked like it was a good call. Omar Gonzalez had a great game. LA Galaxy a player played at the back, and he was very strong defensively, made some crucial headers. Um, but they couldn't hold out all the way in the 55th minute. Uh, Howard made a good save, punched it out, and Muller with uh, just a seminar in finishing, side footed it into the side net. And honestly, the guy really does baffle me at times. His, his finesse is, is amazing, and his movement. But um, Germany, they, they didn't seem like they were pushing too much for another goal. I mean, they had a couple of chances. Even the US had a chance at at the end to tie it up um, but as results went their way uh, in the Portugal and Ghana game they go through to the last 16 uh, in the group of death they pulled off the unthinkable um, but after seeing Ghana and Portugal I mean both I think the US definitely deserved to go through they were the better team so in the next round they're going to wait to see their opponents most likely it'll be Belgium and that'll be another tough task but after seeing what the United States can do um, in these in the group stage there's no saying what can happen in this World Cup you never know so uh, if you want to believe that you can win you go ahead and do it I'm not going to tell you no um, so with the Turk in the jerk, the, the Turk in the game is going to be uh, Klinsman for me, uh, making some crucial calls uh, for the United States all through the tournament, not just in this game, but he's, he's really been the driving force behind the United States, I think, and their, their road to qualifying. Well, the jerk, I'm not going to pinpoint certain players, but I, before the tournament, I was talking about Michael Bradley being a, an enormous influence in this, in this competition for the United States, and he just hasn't done it. I mean, he's lost in the friendly games. He had that drive going forward. Um, and he, he looked as if he could hold possession, but for the United States recently, he just he, for me, he's been very poor in the middle of midfield, giving away the ball a lot. I mean, not as bad a game today, but Portugal he definitely thought he was at fault for the goal, but the reason I'm putting a jerk on him is to try and maybe hopefully he'll watch TYT and think, you know what, I need to get my shit together for the last 16, because that's, uh, that's something that I think the United States really need. So, uh, the bottom line is they go through, Germany lead, uh, go through as group, group leaders, the United States go through, and fair play to them, they definitely deserved it. Stay tuned for more action.